As the investigation continues into the death of a former uh, of a Furman student, I should say, in Hilton Head, we do have the 911 calls from the night people called 911 from that off campus party to get help for Caroline Smith. Hilton Head 911, do you have a police, fire, or medical emergency? Um, it's, it's, I need an EMT. I think this girl is dying. She just fell and hit her head. Okay, I'm what is the here. address of your emergency? Five Enterprise Lane. For verification, can you repeat that? Five Enterprise Lane. Now, the sheriff's office says Smith was drinking when she fell and hit her head on Saturday. It'll be weeks before the coroner is able to determine how she died. You told me she fell. Is that did you did you see her fall, or did she tell you she fell? No, someone was back there with her, and and he said she fell. Okay, are you with her now? Yes, we're, we're, but do you want to talk to the gentleman who saw her fall? No, how old is she? I don't know. I, I've never met if her. You, I, you could tell me 20. approximately? 22. Okay. Is she awake? Uh, no, she's not awake. She's unconscious. Okay. Is she breathing? Unconscious. Uh, I don't think so. Is she breathing? Caroline's boyfriend told deputies he performed CPR, but she was pronounced dead when EMS arrived. The community is dealing with an extremely difficult time as family and friends continue to heal from this terrible loss. They describe Caroline as one of a kind and someone who had a huge impact on everyone she met. Furman University will hold a memorial service for Caroline on Tuesday next week in the Daniel Memorial Chapel.